reading of the New Testament. Uh, that would be this would be a translation or something of the uh, King James version of the uh, New Testament as rendered by the uh, Gullah culture. This is uh, the Gullah Bible. Uh, let's see. I'm not going to move from uh, Galatians. I sound, well, I, I, mean, let's move, let's say, I move one page back, right? Be Galatians 3. Why don't we do Galatians? Uh, hey, why don't we do Galatians 3 3? Why not? Okay, hold on. Got to do the glasses. You know why? Because, you know, when I read from the Gullah Bible, this is the Gullah, and this is the translation. The translation is smaller. And I'm I'm an old man, so I need reading glasses. Okay, here we go. Uh, Galatians three, three, page uh, six, forty-three. Ona ain't got no sense. God's spirit make ona straight far live this new way. Far show ona ain't want far try far live. The res o owner, life on her own way, just by on her own power, ain't he? And the translation, are ye so foolish, having begun in the spirit, are ye now made perfect by the flesh? Once again, we do this twice. Galatians 3, 3, page 643. Ona ain't got no sense. God's spirit make Ona straight far live this new way. For sure, Ona ain't one for try for live the rest of Ona life on her own way. Just by on her own power, ain't he? And the translation once again is are ye so foolish, having begun in the spirit, are ye now made perfect by the flesh? There you go, reading. Oh, by the way, just uh, I know on Sundays I usually give, this is Monday, I usually give uh, some explanations, but I'm traveling. So this is the last one I'm reading from this location. Um, tomorrow I read from New York, but I won't have my set. Got to break down my, well, my set, I mean, my set meaning the, you know, the flag by the, uh, the, the cat, the, the artist flag right there. And I, I actually, I wonder too, this picture people want to know. Not people want to know. That's not true. No, well, I want to know. I want to tell you. Let's put it that way. Um, let me show you. Not show you. But read it to you. It's a, a picture. Well, I don't want to take it off. Well, I'll take it off. Okay. I'll take it off. Just push pinned on the wall. I just picked up because it's, it's, it looks like a scholar, don't he? And, you know, from this seat, we do scholarship stuff. This is not going to go with me to South Africa. So it's going to stay here. When I get back in August, then I'll have the set back. Eh? Okay. This is Whitfield Lovell, born 1959. Maybe the cat's still alive. Uh, oh, it's a car. Maybe that's. Well, let's see. I don't know. It's a card, card series, too. The rounds X twenty. I'm gonna say uh, two, two thousand six to two thousand eleven. Uh, mixed media charcoal on paper. I like charcoal on paper. Uh, actually, like watercolor. But if you're gonna be an artist, my suggestion to you is uh, hey, when you start not do watercolor. It's the most difficult. But just do watercolor. Oh, the other thing, if you if you're gonna be an artist, make sure. You do the uh, the anatomy kind of thing, you know, with the with the skeleton and the model next to it. You do all the da da da, -da and learn all the bones of them. I don't think all this stuff. Okay, mix the other. Whitfield Lovell, courtesy of DC Moore Gallery, New York. Well, maybe I go to DC Moore Gallery and see what's going on. Got to go up to New York. I ain't gonna have time to get pictures. Lovell's charcoal portrait drawings invite viewers to explore ideas of identity and anonymity. The artist renders. His drawings from pho photographs of unknown individuals, okay, that he often pairs with found objects. This drawing is part of a series of 54 portraits 
in which he combined each drawing with a card from a deck of round playing cards. Okay, so this is an unknown. This is good. This is what I'm saying. This he, he, he a scholar. No, that's right. I, I couldn't be in the, the, you know, with the glass and like that. He got to be from the teens, you know, the 19, 19, you know, when the boule first started, you know, or the, in, the, in the 20s or maybe even the 30s. Now, I think it's got to be the way. Anyway, but his, uh, <laughs> the card, he's these round cards he's got, I guess with each one, whatever. But his guy, this guy's round card is the Ace of Spades. The Ace of Spades. Get it? Okay, sorry. Um, anyway, but I like this. I'm going to keep it up on this wall. You know, I'll push it back in the wall. After I say goodbye to you. I'm saying goodbye to you. It would be uh, me, T, from the Pattersons, taking the trains to bed, letting you know what I only suspect.